We just did the protocol where he was resting. So you can see now this is the data. This is a pretty normal ECG. Right here is when he was laying down, when he was resting. Okay, right here is when he was sitting up normally. So it got a little bit faster, probably because he had just stood up. Right here is when he was breathing in and out. So you can see this point is when he inhaled, and this point is when he exhaled. And so you go through, you see when he was exhaling, it was a little bit of a longer ECG. Okay, so we're gonna take the data from this. What you want is you want the time and the amplitude. That's right here, time and amplitude. And you want that for each wave, P wave, QRS wave, and T wave. So I blew up the ECG so it's a lot easier to see. So you're gonna take your cursor, and this is your P wave right here. So you're gonna go from the start of the P wave to the end of the P wave. And you'll see this is time and this is amplitude. Those are the two things you want. And you're gonna to wanna to find three different P waves and do the same thing. Okay, the next thing you're gonna do is the QRS wave. So you're gonna find that Q wave and you're gonna to go to the bottom of the QRS wave. So you'll see right here, the bottom of that S wave. It's gonna be a little hard to get exactly, so just try your best. So that's your time and your amplitude. Next is your T wave, that's right here. So you're gonna go from the beginning of that to right about that end. And again, time and amplitude. The last thing you're gonna to wanna to find is the heart rate, beats per minute. So that's right here. And you wanna go R to R. So here's an R wave. Here's an R wave. What I like to do is I like to blow it up a little bit more just so it's a little bit easier to grab. So I'm gonna take that R wave, try and get exactly on it. It's a little bit difficult. And you're gonna go to that next R wave. And that's gonna show your beats per minute. So it shows here while he was laying down, he had a resting heart rate of 36 beats per minute, which seems pretty low, but for him, that's fairly normal.